an unfurling of national pride against the iconic backdrop of New Delhi's Red Fort. Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi saluted his country's resilience over its 75 years of independence and laid out his vision for the final quarter of the century. We must make India a developed nation in our lifetime. The youngsters aged 20, 21, 25 who are here in front of me, the youth of my country. When India celebrates 100 years of independence, you will be 50 to 55 years old, which means the golden period of your lives, the next 20 to 25 years of your lives, will be the time to make India's dreams come true. Homes and businesses across India have been called to fly the national flag as part of a patriotic government campaign. Meanwhile, opposition parties say they were excluded from the day's celebrations and accuse Modi's Hindu nationalist government of undermining the country's democratic and religious freedoms. Speaking to France 24, India's ambassador to France disagreed with that assessment. You just have to go to bookshops and see any number of books that are both uh, critical of the government, critical of many things that we still need to do to get our uh, democracy more perfect. Every religion is um, you know, woven into the social fabric. They have constitutional guarantees. Modi himself did not respond to criticism in his 80-minute speech, nor did he address India's tense ties with neighbors like Pakistan. The two countries became independent at the same time in 1947, following the end of British colonial rule and the bloody period of partition. Pakistan celebrated its independence over the weekend, and on Sunday, guards from both countries held a joint ceremony at their border.